This morning, Dr. Robert Jeffress reminded me of something long forgotten. He spoke of the funeral services for Dr. Martin Luther King, Jr. He said that a big black man by name of James Bevels went to the platform, stood behind the rostrum, and began to speak, and the first thing he said was that Dr. Martin Luther King, Jr. was not our leader. And the crowd began to murmur and wonder what he was saying and where he was going. And then he continued. He said, our leader is the one that led the children of Israel out of Egypt. Our leader is the one who was with Daniel in the lion's den. Our leader is the one who was in the furnace with the three Hebrew children. Our leader is the one who stood outside an empty grave and said, Mary, don't touch me because I have not yet ascended to the Father. And he was the one that revealed himself to the disciples in the upper room. He was the one that conquered death, hell, and the grave. That's our leader. And you know, he still is our leader. Our leader is the Lord Jesus Christ, who still is outside the grave, who has conquered death, hell, and the grave, and who is victorious, and who invites us to share in that victory. I am so thankful that our leader is alive. He is the one that was alive and is alive and will be alive forevermore. Jesus Christ, incarnate Son of God, he's alive. Look forward to seeing you celebrate with us together on this Easter Sunday morning. Thank you, Jesus. Thanks for watching Don Howell. Today's Light and Love from Liberty.